Join me and my dad on a 109 mile bike ride through the Black Hills of South Dakota. We started in Deadwood, South Dakota on the George S. Mickelson Trailhead. It was so awesome. You've got to ride on mountain bikes because the trail is muddy. It's got some gravel. There's not too much crazy terrain, but it is a bit of a drive all the way down to Edgemont, South Dakota. And while we were on mountain bikes, it's not too difficult and challenging. Anyone could really ride it. It's just that our trip was always, always raining. Like every second of the entire ride, it was raining or drizzling or windy, but we did get some spectacular views. I mean, check this out. It was beautiful and green everywhere, but still it was rainy and rough and you were constantly moving. But we did find these really cool tunnels that you got to drive through because the Mickelson Trail is a old railroad trail that was converted into a bike trail. And we found four of those tunnels, but the views were amazing. The weather was not that fantastic, but there were beautiful cities to stop along the way, to grab lunch and so forth. But we spent about 10 hours riding on this trail to get to our destination. And while we battled the rain, it really was a spectacular event. And we got to see so many things that most people don't get to see. And again, all from the perspective of our beautiful mountain bikes. So as we were going through the mountains and the rain, we decided so many times that it might be a great time to turn back, but not once did we chicken out because this trail was absolutely amazing. So if you get a chance, check it out. It's the Mickelson Trail in South Dakota. We loved it.